because this is another women-owned, mom-owned, mom-powered brand. Myself and the team here, we had to change, re change every week, depending upon, I have nine-year-old twins, so we were trying to homeschool them. Um, my husband has a job that he was still going into work because he's in healthcare, so we just had to figure it out. Well, moms are known for multitasking, but this was a whole new set of challenges as a global pandemic strangled economies around the world. Lots of entertaining products. So Wendy Knight went back to her creative instincts. Started doing curbside pickup. We started creating like DIY kits to keep families busy here in our community because we were all at home struggling with balancing homeschooling all of a sudden, people working at home and all of those challenges. So nice idea for Lemons and Limes was to showcase the talented artisans, not just in the local area, but across the world from places as far away as China. It's the spirit of collaboration that helped push her to provide better service and more options. I really want to be sort of that vector for a lot of our local artisans that are super talented, but maybe they just don't have the time to build the infrastructure of a website or all the social media that you need to do. Knight says every piece of jewelry, shirt or gift idea is made with a community in mind and the thought that collaboration is more valuable than competition. She says when times were tough, she leaned on the lessons her family and two remarkable twins, Lauren and Andrew, have taught her. It was a battle. And it changed me at the core of who I am. And that my, the twins came in my life to teach me the lesson, I think, to stop chasing perfection every day and sort of enjoy the journey and start enjoying a little bit of the chaos and the mess because it's OK. But there are some incredible talents and skills that come with being a mom. So there's some more good news here. Knight is opening the Loveland Mercantile inside that first brick and mortar store in Loveland, and then we'll open her second shop in Sims Township right on Montgomery Road. I'm Colin Mayfield, WLWT News 5.